people ask me all the time, hey, you know, I understand, Peter, that as I my my workload increases, my production of lactate increases. And as my production of lactate increases, my capacity starts to fall off because as lactate goes up, it's married to a hydrogen ion and that's what creates the acid part of lactic acid. And it's that hydrogen ion that's causing all the trouble. It's not the lactate. We can tolerate endless amounts of lactate. We just can't tolerate the hydrogen that comes with it. And it's that hydrogen that actually paralyzes the actin myosin filaments, prevents them from disengaging. And that's what leads to that seizing up that you feel when you exceed your lactate threshold. So so what is the state of buffering agents to reduce and lessen the impact of lactic acidosis? I've been very fortunate over the last decade to be involved in a lot of edge case uh, researches. But Gustav's highest view to max actually is done under bicarbonate uh, utilization. Not How? Christian, but Gustav. How? How is it administered? It is packed in a hydrogel. You basically pack the agents into a vehicle. To, to, to deliver it where you need it uh, more efficiently. So this means that we can go to concentrations that are significant. What have you seen is the difference in his lactate tolerance with and without this buffering? 